I work at the Space Geology Facility where we track Earth observation satellites with two lasers and my job is to maintain those lasers. We're one of around 40 stations worldwide which are part of the International Laser Ranging Service and they provide a priority list of which satellites we track. We track satellites from around about 250 kilometres out to about 20,000 kilometres out and we can provide orbital accuracies of around about a centimetre. It's important to know where these satellites are because they get heavily influenced by external forces in the atmosphere, so atmospheric drag or solar winds. And essentially, if you don't know where your satellite is, and for instance, it's measuring the ice caps and telling us the ice caps are melting, the information it's taking is useless. Satellites can be launched with different tracking techniques, but those tracking techniques can fail when we go up to track a satellite. It may not be where we expect it to be. It can be, for instance, bounced off by solar flares, moved along its orbit, or it may just not be there because they've manoeuvred it but haven't told us what it's doing. So it has been known for satellites to get lost and we're the guys who come to the rescue and find their satellites again. Some of our main satellites we track are Lagos 1 and Lagos 2, which have a very, very stable orbit um, and a predicted return time of about 3 million years. Those satellites provide us, our station, a precise location which essentially tells us that we're moving away from America about the same rate as your fingernails are growing. I love my job. I can't think of any better job really. I get to play with lasers, I get to play with optics, I get to do analysis work, I get to play with fantastic bits of equipment. You couldn't ask for a better job. <laughs>